sir, so many people one thing one thing i have noticed sir one thing mm-hmm. i have noticed as tirtha was uh, you know mentioning in the uk there was also you know a much hue and cry regarding the corona or to to purchase the sanitizer and all that yes, exactly. material human mm-hmm. tendencies are same everywhere human yeah. tendencies are same everywhere to create panic you know among small small things and uh, you know to buy to buy things at random to fetch the things they yes, are i have to get it my home i have exactly. to get it my home exactly. let the people go to the walls so i think uh, but tendency <laughs> particularly indian same, society same. is orthodox particular indian society is bit orthodox as compared to those people because uh, first uh, it is uh, for the very first time we face this situation pandemic situation so that is why these things happened otherwise indian people do not bother about health and hygiene you see people at ganga <laughs> exactly. bathing you see people exactly. at uh, pe- people at ganga how they bathe you know foreigners used to come and when they saw these people bathing over there they said no germs can do any harm to indian people <laughs> yeah we had we have herd immunity we yes, we, yes, we yes. go to we have we have golgappa with uh, yes, unwashed are, hands but still we are yes. living thanks to corona that we have become thanks to corona that we have become so health conscious now health conscious and hygienic also yes <laughs> it is it is like this actually the uh, friendly uh, university ship like they published in india many people are not dying mortality rate it is not that much because 94.5% uh, is recovery rate just imagine yeah. sir because of fear the... of these kinds of virals so that is why <laughs> yeah. is actually Very. actually sir it's sure. quite funny it is it is quite funny but sir this is reality also right yeah this is also reality so guys so let's move to the uh, the second uh, activity and uh, i hope guys you have researched a lot that exploitation of natural resources so let's start here we speak uh, you may see that china many developing countries and developed countries you may see that uh, everywhere mining projects are going on <laughs> and uh, carbon emission it is on that level water level uh, water level is increasing and uh, our land mass you know we are decreasing so how do you see these all things uh, yes who would speak first willingly <laughs> i will uh, yes speak second all right yes mr chawad i think you should go yes sir about yeah. exploitation of natural resources yes 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 and all that sir i think these are as i already mentioned in my earlier discourses that these are the fallouts of globalization mm-hmm. you know exchange of exchange of cultures exchange of economies production exchanges technic technological advances and all that matters that matters for this exploitation of resources because there is enough in the world i think there is enough in the world to fulfill the needs now we have entered the whole humanity has entered into the phase of greed i think they want more and more but the sources are limited already and what 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 they are doing sir consistently what they are doing they are digging the earth they are digging the earth for more advantages for more exploitation uh, sources uh, exploitation of the sources so that is why that balance between ecology and human beings the men and environment that ecological balance has been disturbed and i think these pandemics are the genuine you can see the evidence of that disturbance between the relation of mankind and environment environment so we are bound to see all these things and as said due to due to corona i think it is a message of the nature to mankind it is a humble or you, you can say it is a subtle message by the nature that try to follow the norms natural norms other while i shall i shall ruin you i shall ruin you and you are like it is a, it is a warning for us and you are like a species for me like other species otherwise 
you are like a species to me as other species i will ruin you totally and i think there's a need for us now to understand that balance we are we should not supposed to go, go against all those elements of fire water air you know the, those five elements so that balance whenever it got disturbed you know sir there's my personal research over that whenever our, our body get some disease whenever we face some disease there is a, you know that energy which we are deriving from that uh, nature those five elements somewhere that energy got disturbed we we are distracted from the nature as and when we got distracted from the nature we got some disease there i believe i think sir so that energy which is you know inserting which is being inserted by nature upon uh, in us in human beings there is some uh, you know glitch in that energy so then we are bound to follow you know bound to uh, uh, prone to the diseases i think so i think it's a more alarming situation for the human beings to curtail all those expectations because uh, at the end of the table we are all endeavoring to get food on our table that's all our needs are very limited but in the wake of globalization liberalization and so on these tendencies are going on man is craving for more and more and that is not sufficient a thing i think done sir yeah very good very good mr chabra and uh, yesterday mr singh was giving some advice like we should go some some extent we can go with that all right mr chabra you were speaking fantastic and you have good command on grammar and pronunciation also bereti tirtha i'm coming uh this is the area like you speak um 95% correct but only 5% it is some areas are there whenever it got disturbed whenever it gets disturbed all right so it remember get, or got is okay sir no no gets it would be okay gets gets okay Dis- done sir yeah whenever it right, gets sir. disturbed yeah it gets, those element uh get disturbed that time we face yeah we get problem all right we because it was happening it is happening and it would happen i mean we would use present like sir, i yeah, rectify yes tirtha please sure so the uh, today's topic is exploit uh, exploitation of natural resources uh sir firstly i would like to thank you that uh, you just gave us this uh, uh, um, good topic which uh, which should be uh, like discussed uh, this topic is actually very 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 vital in now our days so i would like to point out few uh, to- few uh, like what we call few uh, causes why we exploit our natural resources so first we have to understand that world population right now our world population is 7.7 billion right and if we talk about in our uh, india we have 1.33 crores people living in india and we have small areas we don't have large places like large areas like china russia or uh, america we have uh, we living in a very small land but sir what is uh, we are facing first thing sir over consumption we consume everything over right we want everything over and over we don't satisfy ourselves in a uh, like uh, the required amount right so what we are doing is uh, we are um, simply Uh, over consuming the natural resources like sir the land forest uh, river right second thing said lodging today's generation whether they are living in village or whether they are living in uh, cities the villagers they want to come to uh, come to cities they don't want to live in a uh, forest because the development is not happened there right so what people what uh, the cities people is doing they are simply cut cut the forest areas and occupy that land and build the new buildings so what will happen definitely sir we are exploiting the natural resources right secondly sir pollution we humans are creating so much pollution 
did you uh, did you notice one thing that when pandemic has started world has shut down right for a couple of month so we have been observing so many changes that animals they came from uh, forests they roaming freely in the cities so many dolphins they came through uh, sea to the uh, rivers like saryu nadi if you re read somewhere that dolphins came through a sea to the uh, saryu nadi right then uh, second thing sir poor farming process we definitely depend on our farmers but do you know that how our farmers is uh, uh, affecting our uh, nature there are so many uh, we have been uh, um, heard that that they were burning their crop openly government is always advising them that please do not do that please give some time give some um, uh, spend some little bit money and dug the uh, mud and uh, put it uh, your uh, waste uh, cop to that uh, mud simply they can do that but no they use so many chemical to uh, increase their crop increase their quality of crop right so, so that is also a form of a uh, uh, exploitation of natural resources Th uh, thirdly sir the new technologies like sir every day every month every week there are new cars uh, new cars coming there are new uh, technologies are coming there are new rockets are launching there are new new uh, airplane uh, is making right so they all these things are actually creating uh, exploiting the nature they creating so so many pollution sir we we are not talking about pollution we only want new technologies so what is what will happen sir our nature is going to move in worse situation then secondly sir uh, we humans are making our rivers um, dirty so our rivers are you know dying now our rivers uh, they matlab uh, previously our river uh, cover whole india almost whole india like like ganga for example uh, ganga ganga uh, ji is uh, uh, what we call sir starting uh, started from himalaya to uh, ending to matlab uh, cover uh, all over whole india but all over mostly india right but now it is going now it is dying sir we humans are so selfish and we only making our nature uh, yeah we do not understand that what will happen only we want the more uh, and more from our nature so that is what is the reason sir all right That's very good very good teta you have spoken you. you have uh, addressed uh, many point amazing yes sir thank you a uh, little bit take back and i'm coming uh, mr chawda if uh, you may uh, think about it artificial intelligence it has come in picture and these days many countries are practicing so how do you see that we are uh, like whatever mining projects are going on but we are also interfering in natural you know that uh, uh, whatever we have cycle and all whatever is happening so we are also in the frame so what is your opinion on this all right recently uh two and three days ago it was in uh, article that china they are very advanced you know that they are researching and maybe mm. in future they would use as a weapons so what is your opinion on this that yeah artista uh, feedback which yes, should we discuss or discuss all right because you discuss. are using should be so yeah third form should, should be you discuss okay sir yeah farmers is not farmers are all right please take care farmers whenever are. you are speaking so singular and plural subject account really that we have to use helping verb all okay. right next technology techno lazy 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 all right lazy technology Techno Tec technology technology uh, techno uh, technology technology logi not logi not lazy lazy technology technology techno technology ha uh, yes, yes yes okay sir and uh, airplanes is making not airplanes are being made all right okay yeah build you may use okay sir okay sir yes yes mr chawda how do you see that uh, we are interfering 
in natural system so what do you see here with respect to artificial intelligence